this is a Pimpy Matte mini vid, and this is like an eagle hug pose. I've gotten a lot of questions lately about things for SI joints, and this is a huge helper. So just lay on your back on the mat, okay? You're gonna cross one knee over the other one, just like you're crossing your legs. So you do whatever you can in your body in this capacity, then bring knees in towards your chest, and reach up and hug what you can. Really draw it close to you, if it's uncomfortable, if it's difficult to grab, you can get a yoga strap, a scarf, or a towel to help pull you in. You're just trying to bring it as close to you as possible, and you're probably going to feel some stuff in the hip or maybe in the back of the tushy. It depends on your body where you really need it, but stay here. You can hug and bring this in for up to two minutes. So if you have time to really work on it, you might set a little timer, maybe on your phone, or if you've got a good old egg timer in the kitchen, just set it for two minutes and hang here and hug. Then when that time is up, you're going to carefully unravel, unlace, sort of relace, recross the other direction, and do the same thing. Reach up and grab and hug it towards you. Um, you're aiming for that outside leg to grab and pull in. So again, if that's difficult to do, get a yoga strap, get a scarf, even a belt and a pinch. Anything that will help wrangle and pull you to yourself, that's what you want. Okay. And again, you can stay up here for up to two minutes. If you um, don't have that kind of time, like if you're not, don't have the four minutes so that you're even, whatever amount of time you do on one leg, make sure you do it on the other, okay? And then you're gonna unravel, and I'm gonna show you a little bit more advanced, if you can. You can cross and then try to wrap. So you'll notice, you know, like eagle pose from yoga, and then try to drag into you also. Again, because my focus is always Pilates, you always wanna have your core nice and tight for things to help stabilize your insides to get to those funky bits that we want to try to get healthier, okay? So then unravel, cross, and maybe double cross if you can. Oh, double cross makes it sound like you're in trouble. You're not in trouble. You're not double crossing anybody. You're doing really yummy things for your SI joints here, okay? So just hug for five, four, three, two, one. And that is your little eagle hug pose to help with um, SI joint issues. So if you've got SI joint pain, you might try throwing that in either before workout or after workout, or if you're at your desk at work and things get really, really sticky, just sort of bust that out on the floor, right? Thanks, and I will see you next time.